What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Brittany, and we are back with another video. So, you guys, first of all, disclaimer, if you hear my kids and or husband, it's because I usually film these videos when they're asleep, but they're still very much awake right now. So, if you hear them, just disregard. <laughs> but last time I came to you all with a little Timu haul, y'all didn't believe me. I told y'all that they were comparable to Amazon because they have so many items. Last time I came on here, I basically tried on the fashion side of things. I tried on some cute little outfits for you all, one of which I have on today. And baby, when I tell you I had so many compliments on this outfit today, like I had so many compliments on this outfit today. Yes, this outfit is from Timu, so don't sleep on them. But I was comparing them to Amazon, and I was like, "Nah, not Amazon. They don't. They don't have anything. They just have some clothing items. Like it's just clothing items." But no, you're wrong. And today I'm here to prove to you all that they offer a lot more than clothing items okay so in these packages right here i have me some more timo items that i want to show you all today so sit back relax and enjoy the haul all right so on this second part of this timo haul i want to show you all the things that i got that can benefit the home okay the things that can benefit the house and so the first thing i want to start with is this thermometer so in this house we love to grill we love to cook and this thermometer this is a cooking thermometer right here and you see it has the probe that you can stick into your meat so this right here is definitely going to come in handy in our house okay all right you guys the second item that i picked out is this right here this right here is a portable and rechargeable battery juice blender okay if y'all have been watching my channel y'all know your girl loves to juice it is a thing for me and so i got this i picked this up you guys because i can just carry this on the go i'm so excited about this here and yes i definitely want you all to check my description box for a special 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 offer on this item here I have a fan exclusive offer for you all for this item here. This is originally priced on Timu for $10.59, which is already a very good steal, okay? But just for you all here on my channel, if you use my code, you can get this item for, I don't even want to say it because it's more like, I know y'all are going to be running, running to Timu to get this. You can get this item for $1.50, you guys, $1.50 by using my code. So definitely you all go and grab this item here. It is a portable, a portable blender. You can mix your drinks up here. You can mix your smoothies up here. You can mix all of your good juices up here and take it on the go. Like I said, it's originally priced for $10.59, but with using my special code, you will get this item for $1.50. What? Literally unbelievable. <laughs> the next item I grabbed is here is this water bottle. This is a water bottle, one of those water bottles that keeps up with your daily tracking of water intake. As you all can see, it has the times on there. Hold on, let me take it out the packaging, you guys. All right, as you all can see, it has the times on there where you will fill this water bottle up and it will tell you how much water you should consume in by that time. You have all your times here throughout the day and you probably re refill this bottle up twice it has an AM side and it has a PM side. So you will have this water bottle. You will drink this much 
you will drink a whole bottle through 1 p.m. And then you will start back over at 2 p.m. and finish this bottle by 7 p.m. This will make sure you're taking your daily intake of water, okay? So go ahead and grab this as well. So I told you guys they have all of these amazing household products. So the next thing I picked up is something that I can definitely use within the kitchen. This here is a jar opener. Don't you sometimes have those jars that you just can't seem to open? Like, it's like, where's my man? I need a man to open this. No, once you got this in hand, you can open up any jar or bottle that you need. This right here can open up any size jar or container that you need to open. You got your big size here, medium size here, smaller sizes, and the smallest size. The smallest jar bottle of hot sauce. You can open up right here. You just put that thing in and crank it open. Y'all would definitely be seeing me use this in upcoming videos because your girl be struggling. So, if you know me, you know your girl loves to eat some crab legs, right? And we all know. Don't nobody got no crab leg crackers at home. So, nobody got no crab leg crackers at home. But now I do. But now I do. I can use the item right here, this little gadget right here, to crack open my crab legs. And guess where it came from? Timu. Timu got your girl right with a nice, this is a very heavy duty crab leg opener. Oh, yes. I'm going to be cracking them crab legs, baby. I'm going to be cracking them crab legs with this right here. Yes, ma'am, I will be. I'm telling you, Timo has everything that it is to offer. Don't sleep on them. This here is a garlic press. We all know that we love to cook with garlic, that nice, fresh garlic. But sometimes, mostly all the times, it's very much hard to actually mince that garlic. This right here, will do the job. You all will definitely be seeing me using this in the kitchen in the very, very, very near future. All right, you guys, so to get out of the kitchen supplies, I just wanna let you all know that they offer a lot more items. They offer a lot more items. So the next thing that I have are these charms here. Charms. If you all do not know, we are like a croc family. We love us some crocs. Me, my kids, we love wearing some crocs. So when I saw these on the Timu site, I had to grab them because they are actually like fans of Sonic. So when I saw all of these cool Sonic charms, y'all see them? Look at that. I was like, okay, I'm definitely gonna have to do a pair of their Crocs in Sonic. Like, look at these Sonic charms. It came with a bag full of, you have your regular Sonic, you have all the characters. I don't even know all the characters, but when I saw them, I said, oh, my kids would love this because they love all things Sonic, okay? So it came with a whole baggie full of Sonic charms and I will definitely be using these charms to decorate a pair of their Crocs. So I know they're gonna be super excited about these here. I love them and I know they will love them even more. Next thing we have on our list is something that all of us girls can use. Like we love us a little makeup. So you know, we always need, we always need uh, some new makeup brushes. So Timo got your girl right by sending me not only one, not only two, but three, three brush sets. Like, let me open these up, you guys. Let me open these up because your girl needs it. Y'all, I need it. So first of all, they come in these cute little pouches here. This is where you will store your brushes at. And then you have your brushes here. You have your brushes here. And let me go ahead and take them out and put them in. So you guys, I've taken out the makeup brushes and I put them into the pouch. 
And you guys, this is what they look like. Like, this is so cute. I got so many cute brushes to choose from that I will need. Like, all of these brushes will come in handy when Zoin is girl makeup. Like, I need this. I, I need this. So, thank you all so much. Timu, like, for coming through for the girl. Like, I can take these on the go. It's like a perfect little traveling size. And it has all of the brushes that I will need. I can keep one at home. I can put one in my purse, one in my traveling bag. Like, what? I absolutely love this item because your girl has recently gotten into makeup. And I'm going to need this. Like, I need this. All right, you guys, so the next item that I have here is something that you all know that I can use. Your girl likes to go to the gym and get her little workout on. So these here will be perfect, perfect, perfect for the gym. They are some shorts, but they have the waist trainer built in. Like your girl can tummy tuck and have the shorts on at the same time. And you guys, the best thing about these are that they have the Sweat band installed. This right here that you see on the inside is going to help your girls sweat all of this belly fat out. Like, this is what your girl needs when she's in the gym trying to work it on out, okay? It's short, comfortable, and it has the waist trainer built in. Perfect garment to put on while you're in the gym working it out, okay? All right, you guys, last but not least, I would like to show you all the items that I got for, guess what? My nails. Y'all know, y'all know that your girl is a press-on type of girl. All of my nails are press-on. So guess what I grabbed from Timu? Guess what I grabbed from Timu? Press-on nails. Let's get into these nails, you guys, because I'm excited about these. So when I seen these nails, I was thinking like, baby, these are meant for the springtime. Like get into them. Are y'all seeing them? You all see all the beautiful colors? So in this box here, we have a couple items, y'all. I've never had one of these and I'm super excited because I do do my own nails. I do not go to the nail salon for nails. So we have this kit here, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm like, Super excited slash nervous to use all of these cool things. But right here we have our drill bits. Let's pull them out. We have our drill bits here. It has your gun. So you will attach your tool to this here. So go ahead. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I feel like I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to feel like a real nail technician using this. Like I got my little thing here. That I'm like, <laughs> like, I'm excited. I'm excited to use this. Oh, we have our whole little kit here to be real little nail technicians. And I got this from where? Timo. And then the last item that I want to show you guys is my UV lamp. Look how cute it is. It's pink, you guys. So when doing my own nails, this is something that I'm definitely going to need. It is a professional gel polish LED nail dryer lamp. Look how cute it is. It's in the color pink. It has your USB port here. This is so cute and I'm so excited to do my nails. So, so if you guys were in doubt on what I was saying in my last video regarding Timu, please do not be. When I tell you guys that Timu has everything that there is to offer, okay? They have everything from fashion to beauty to home to like literally everything they have everything there is to offer so please go ahead and check them out go ahead and check the link in my description don't forget if you want this portable blender for only one dollar and fifty cent please use my coupon code in the description box below to make it happen like what i'm so excited to use this to put on my little good fruits and veggies inside of here make me a nice little smoothie and to take it on the go like, I'm so excited about this. I'm actually so excited about all of my Timu items. Like, like, 
I'm so amazed at everything that they have to offer. So go check them out, use my coupon code, click on the links below and shop with Timo. And on that note, let's get into the rest of the video. What's up you guys and welcome back to my kitchen. Um, today you guys, it is actually the morning time. This is another one of those crock pot meals, you know. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started before you get home so that once you are home, you don't gotta do too much. Check out my outfit first of all. I put my heels on, but this is my outfit that I got from Timu. My cousin actually sent me a little style inspiration shirt idea for a button down shirts. So this is one of the looks that I went with. I basically just took the fronts and crossed them over and tucked them in the side like that, just to give it a little bit more effect. It has a lot of other cute um, ways to style a shirt, but they weren't really work appropriate. So yeah. Um, so today y'all, what we are doing are, for our crock pot meal for today, we are doing some um, country style ribs. And these are beef boneless chuck country style ribs, okay? That's what we got going on. Am I focused? I don't feel like I'm focused. I feel like, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, that's what we're doing, y'all. And I want to make them like with some gravy. So what we're going to be using is a little beef broth, um, our Lipton's onions. Yeah, the Lipton onion, this my thing, okay? I use it for everything. And then we got a can of beefy mushroom and cream of mushroom so we're gonna be using these and pretty much all that's it i'm about to go ahead and season up my um beef ribs really quickly um like i said these are the country style beef ribs these are not like the ones with the bones in it these are the country style so they are boneless um, i'm about to season them up really good probably with some let's see some of my favorites we got where's the seasonings <laughs> got some sloppy mama some black pepper we're gonna keep it real simple because i'm actually running late i have to get to work i had one drop the kids off and then came back home to finish getting myself ready and to get dinner um started so yeah i'm actually running a little late um but i did just want to let y'all know of this crock pot meal i'm actually trying i never seen it before i don't even know if i even had something like this before but i am a trier i will try some stuff so that's exactly what we are doing today. We are trying something. It sounds like it tastes good, right? That's how I cook. If it sounds like it tastes good. And I'm also going to be um, cutting this onion up. So we're going to put the onion in there, the beef the, um, the beef ribs. We're going to season it up real good. And we're going to use all the ingredients I just showed y'all there. Throw it all in the crock pot. And yeah, keep it pushing. I'm probably gonna mix my soups up together so I can make a consistency. I'm gonna mix all of these up in a bowl together. I'll go ahead and do that now. Get that going so that we can have our gravy already pretty much made. Cream of mushroom there. I don't know if y'all can see me, but I told y'all pretty much what we're doing already. I might have to go in with some water, so let me keep that out. I don't need, I have never even used this beefy mushroom, never used it ever. <laughs> so I don't even know what kind of flavor it has, but when I seen it, I was like, maybe this will go good with my crock pot. Um, my crock pot beef, real stuff, whatever. <laughs> my country style ribs. I was like, maybe that'll be a good mixture. So literally just trying it, y'all. And I just want to let y'all know now, just in case it's good. If it ain't good, I'll let y'all know that also. But <laughs> I want to let y'all know now, I got all of those mixed into the bowl. Into the bowl, I'm going to give it a quick mix. And after we season our um, country style ribs, we are going to pour this all over it um, once it's in the crock pot. And we're gonna cut that thing on for eight hours on low. And we're gonna head out of here. Something quick. Let me cut my onions up too. Mm, it smells good. It smells like a good little combination, y'all. It smells like a good combination. Mmm. Gonna 
add our broth. I didn't have much left, so that's why I was like, let me go ahead and use that. Didn't have much left of that. So we rinsed our beef ribs off. They look good, y'all. They look really, really, ooh, look really, really meaty. But that's because they are boneless, so of course they're going to be meaty. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and season them up. I don't have time to look for more seasonings, so we're just gonna make do with what we got right here in front of us. That's what they look like again, nice and pretty. It's focusing on me and not the meat. <laughs> I'll season these up. Like I said, I'm just going to do some Slappy Mama, some black pepper, garlic powder. Dang, I need to find some onion powder at least. What is all the seasonings? Who been in here moving my stuff around? <sighs> yeah. Okay. Let me stop. Let me stop worrying about it because we have to go. I am about to be late to work. That is not a goal. That is not the goal to be late to work, but I'm, I'm going to be. I'm going to tell you that now. I'm going to be. It's already 8.50. So, <laughs> I have to be there at 9. That's why we're trying to make this quick. Yes. I'm so excited to eat this already. I think it's gonna be good, y'all. I think it's gonna be good. I put ranch in everything and it don't ask me why. I just put it on everything. You just give it a little something extra. Just go ahead and turn it up a notch. All right, y'all, that is good. Just do four little simple seasonings. And gonna give this a mix. Have my onion. I'm doing half of the onion, half an onion right here. Go ahead and just slice this. Doesn't really matter. Slice the onion up. All right. Got our onion sliced. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a mix. Mm, this mixture smells so good together. I mean, you can smell your food. That's how you know it's going to be good, okay? You better smell that food. You better smell that food. You ain't smelling it. She ain't doing it right. You ain't did it right. <laughs> All right. My ribs are nice and... Hold on, y'all. You just want to focus on my face. They looking good. Hopefully this is enough for my crew. We ain't gonna have no leftovers. I had two packs, but one was actually still frozen. So I was like, darn it. I could just do one of the packs. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and go over to our crock pot. I'm gonna put some of the onions in the crock pot first for the ribs to sit on. Sit some of them in there. For the ribs to lay on, and I'm put some more on top as well. So we're just gonna lay those in there. They're kind of some of them are still together like this here. This okay because it's gonna all cook down. This is what they look like. All right. Got those in there. I really could use my little crop for this, but it's, it's cool. I'm gonna go on top with the remaining onions. And our gravy. Mmm. 
I know it's gonna smell so good when I come in this house. When I come back in this house this evening, I know it's gonna be smelling good and good. We're just gonna do some um, dinner rolls with this, some rice, and some vegetable medley that I'm gonna make. It's gonna be dinner, y'all. I'm gonna turn this thing on to low. It's on low, and like I said, we're gonna crank it up to eight hours. And there we are, and cover it. Time to go. All right, you guys. So, unfortunately, I do not have any leftovers for today, or they're not having a class for us. So, you guys, I gotta go spend some money. Got to spend some money and go give me some lunch. Um, it's a little cool today, as y'all see. It's a little windy. I don't know if y'all seen that. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. It's probably super annoying because it's annoying me. I know it's annoying y'all. But, um, yeah. Got to go get some lunch today. And I want... Oh, my manager car. Oh, maybe she want to go get lunch already. I want to get me some, I want something spicy, I want something hot, I wanted like hot food because it's cool. So I decided on, I asked my coworker, I was like, you brought your lunch today? She was like, no. But she said she had to eat something light. Um, she said she went to the beach in two weeks, baby, I understand it, okay? And so I was like, I was gonna either eat tropical or my bun boy who from the Vietnamese restaurant. And she was like, ooh, I can do that. I sent her a picture of my um, bum boy who from a while ago. She was like, ooh, that look good. I'll do that with no meat. I said, no meat, girl. You must be on a diet. That's how I knew she was on a diet. Because when she said she was going to eat light, I was like, and then she said, no meat. That ain't like my girl. So, yeah. I'm going to go pick up us some food from there. I'm looking a little cute today. I like how the shirt. I'm glad my cousin sent me those. Um it's a girl on instagram if i can find well i know i can find safety but if i can post it if i remember to post it i'll post it but she styled or maybe i'll try i'll just try some of the styles later on maybe i can just show you some of the styles how on how she um styled like a button-up shirt like i said the other one well the other ways weren't appropriate for work but they were still very cute and i was like okay ideas also what i want to try are you know like these pants these type of pants that i got on i want to try i've seen like um the little hacks on instagram for like oversized pants as well i don't know if these is considered like oversized oversized i gotta see how stretchy the band is because you gotta be able to get your body into the pants you know some of them you know some of those pants that are like really stretchy and it's just like basically one size fits all those pants and you can style them all these different ways i want to try that one day too like we can make dresses and all type of stuff so yeah let me get over here i just want to check in with you guys say what's up i'm looking i'm loving this green everybody's loving this green on me too i'm like yes green thank you timu everybody i done told three people at my job already about timu <laughs> i done told three people that i was like, I was like oh my gosh i want my coworker. she's like can you just be my um stylist but I sure can. She's like, where did you get it from? I was like, actually, I got it from Timu. And she was like, Timu, I just heard about that. I was like, yeah, it's the new thing. It's the new thing. So, Timu, I'm putting y'all alone, okay? I'm putting y'all on. I'm putting y'all alone. And I gave her my YouTube. She was like, what's your YouTube? And I told her. Oh my gosh, I be always so cringe when I give my coworkers and stuff my YouTube because it's like, baby, y'all don't, you'll never know what your girl gonna be on there talking about. Like, YouTube is my space to be myself, but she's real cool. So, and some of my coworkers definitely already watch, you know. Um, I know those people who watch because they let me know they watch. Like, girl, I seen none of you, so you had posted that. Blah, blah, blah. So, I know they watch, but. <laughs> When I give new people my YouTube, that's like I really don't even share it to my social media anymore. And I need to start back at least on Instagram because I don't think I have like my bosses following me on Instagram. But I don't know because I have like fourteen thousand followers on Instagram and I don't know who's following me. 
but I know I follow him on Facebook and I used to like share my links to Facebook and at the time I probably was talking junk about my job <laughs> I was like let me stop sharing these videos to Facebook because any day like he knows I do, I do um, YouTube it was like any day he could just like oh let me see I like this picture this thumbnail let me see what Brie doing on this video and then it's me talking junk about my job but I know I'm gonna talk junk about my job no more because we're in a great we're in a great space <laughs> we're in a great space so now they, they finally saw my worth and now we're good we don't have any problems <laughs> but yeah let me go get this food and i will get back with y'all in a minute look how childish i gotta look i gotta make a beat up because two things when eating this you shouldn't wear makeup because you're gonna get splashed in the face and might wanna wear a beer or some clothes you don't care about because when you're eating the noodles, you got the chopsticks and you got the spoon slurping noodles up. It's flashing. So your girl got like a little stain right there on her shirt. I'm like, oh, I don't know. We ain't finna do that. That ain't what we doing. So I had to go make me a little bib and you know, hopefully I can be good. All the makeup from around my mouth and up here down my chin might be gone when I'm done but it's real good boy boy what is it called bun bun boy who who bun boy who <laughs> yeah it's real good Hi, you guys so your girl is well I had to go to the vinyl store I feel like it's a routine now to go to this darn vinyl store <laughs> and I probably already got the vinyl at home but it'd be like I don't want to get home at night and the vinyl store closes at 5 30 so it's like nothing i can do um and i need to make, work on that shirt that night and you yeah, should really just be up on it be more prepared and look the night before to know like okay what shirt no what shirts i'm doing and just look because i have a lot of vinyl on hand but then i think about the design and think okay do i have enough of that to do you know so yeah i've been at the vinyl store for like every day however i am Pulling up to the boys' practice. I really do need to go to the grocery store to go grab some dinner rolls, and the boy needs the boys need some milk for cereal in the morning. So I need to do that. But I'm about to run up to this practice because I have truth and sincere stuff. Their coach actually, even though because I'm a teen mom, I get a lot of the information from the park director. Um, and I know on last Thursday it was raining, so a lot of the games were canceled. And we practice on a softball field. A lot of the so softball plays on like Thursdays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Not not Tuesdays, because we play on Tuesdays. They play on Thursdays, I know for sure. And some of their games were canceled on, well, all their games were canceled on Thursday. And so now they have to have makeup games this week. And like she sent us the calendar for the makeup games. And the calendar that I got, it did not have any games at our park on Monday. But the coach messaged us about four something and was like, hey, stand by for practice. Um, I'm waiting for a call back to see if OP was right there. There's some girls on the field. <laughs> but still, it didn't say it on the calendar. So I guess they just added that. Like on the original calendar, she sent us on Friday with the makeup schedule. It didn't say that there was going to be games. But I do see some girls over there warming up. So I'm pretty sure they are having a game they got uniforms on they just don't have on practice clothes but anywho so that's your sincere team wealth is practicing now i'm about to see if fortune wants truth and sincere stuff like still get them some practice in because i think they in the message group right now asking like is anybody free to practice tomorrow yeah i know wealth has a game on he has games on tuesday so um i mean we'll be at this park anyway so if he does if he does let me just if they do go to practice it's gonna be like i'm gonna be watching will's game i'm not gonna be over there at practice you know of course let me go down here and ask fortune if he wants the boys stuff so that they can practice after will's practice and my boys just got home for practice and they turn their favorite song on Are you 
other in their foods, you guys. Beef ribs, rice. Truth, I already ate both these pieces of bread already. Turn around, Truth. Me too. Oh my God. Wait, I ate all y'all bread without eating the rest of y'all food first. <laughs> I didn't know it was that tasty. Never eat all y'all food. Never. You try to beat. Boy, you better eat all your food. <laughs> Nothing, never. Truth, use your fork. My mama didn't tell you that it was Ninky. Alright, y'all. Let me fix me and daddy plate. Alright, you guys. Mommy, here is dinner. Mommy, right. this, mommy. You like it? They like their vegetables. Dinner is done. We have our dinner rolls here. We have our mixed veggies, which consists of broccoli, um, tricolor peppers, purple onion, a little mushroom, and broccoli. And then we have our beef rib here. Our bones beef rib, and then our wild rice. And yeah, you guys, this is dinner for tonight. The boys over here tearing their food up. Mama, we're looking at the sun go. Huh? 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 We're looking at the sun go. Who did what? Look at the sun go. The sun go. Yeah. They just want to listen to Soulja Boy all night. Why they want to do this in the Soulja Boy? <laughs> Okay. Remix, I guess. Turn them on a soldier boy last week and they have been hooked ever since. Every night they come down here and be like, Alexa, turn on Soldier Boy. Superman. And they be like into it a lot. Like they be all in here. They don't know that I am teaching them dance routine, but they're not getting it all the way, so Alright, you guys, we're about to eat. The boys already eating me, daddy about to eat. And so, yo, yo, I will talk to y'all in a little bit.